Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm gonna give you three quick tips for math teachers and math students who are using Google Documents. Let's go ahead and take a look at my sample Google document here that says math tips for Google Docs. And the first tip I wanna show you is right here in the view menu where we can show the equation toolbar and have that turned on and readily accessible to us at any time. Now, the next thing I wanna show you is when we go to the insert menu and we'll go down here, we can choose equation or we can choose special characters and then choose symbol and math and you can pick any of the math symbols that you need to use or want to use and insert them directly into your document. And you can see here, if I highlight, I can then simply increase the font size and it increases the size of the symbol. Now, the third option is to get a math extension. The third tip, go up to the extensions or the add-ons menu and select add-ons, get add-ons, and you'll find a bunch of math add-ons. If you just type in math, you'll see there's a whole bunch of them like equation editor for math and math equations and math algebra console, math quiz maker, and lots of others. Let's try this one right here and we'll see there's a whole bunch of equation editors that we can add in to our Google Documents. As always, for more things like this, please visit freetechforteachers.com or subscribe to my YouTube channel.